What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? It is Rexy here. Welcome back to another one versus one rank duel. I have a fun video in store for you today. Uh, can't say. Okay, my cats are like scratching at the door to get in, but I can't have them using the wheel in the background. I have something very exciting. Um, this is an idea by Chris. Honestly, I kind of forgot that this item existed, dude. I completely forgot that this item existed. It's called Sekmes. It's one of the scepters. Like, I thought he was pulling a, like, like, uh, these nuts joke on me. But, it's true. This is an item. It's called Sekmets. It gives 10% cooldown. After healing yourself with an ability, for the next 5 seconds, each time you damage an enemy god with your non-cooldown on ultimate abilities, they're reduced by 1 second. Uh, it occur, only occur once per second. It affects me. Occur only 12 seconds. So, it's quite similar to Bumbus. I'm not gonna lie. So, I think I am just gonna start a Jotuns. I think that is the play. We go Jotuns. Actually, no, we, we can just go Transcendence. We can go somewhat of a normal build with this. Uh, I'm trying to balance out exactly how much cooldown we're gonna do, but we're gonna do Bobble with it as well and combine that, dude. It's gonna be... Nope. Shoot. It's going to be pretty broken, my guy. And I love playing Guan Yu, so this is a treat for me. So, shout out to Chris T. Dixon for... The idea. Anyways, let's do this, boys. Man, use this shard. Oof. Ooh, chalice as well. The full health chalice heal. I see you're a man of culture as well. Okay, that actually sucks that I messed up. Protections were reduced in everything. Back up here. Oh my. Ever heard of archers? Have I ever heard of HP? I'm dead. Archers, please do it! Ah, oh, damn. <laughs> that was well played, but I didn't even, honestly, didn't even know he had Aegis. Oh, bro. You're crazy. You're crazy. So we could just... Okay, so let's think about the build. Transcendence will be 10%, right? We could go Breastplate, which is another 10%, tw uh, 20%. Hydras. Oh, wait, no. Oh, and we already have the Warrior 10%. Shit! My god, I don't need much cooldown. Okay, so I could go Regrowth. Transcendence, Regrowth. Hydras. Sphinx, but... Fuck me! Okay, we're gonna overcast. I don't give a shit, dude. Dude, there's way too many items that have cooldown that I need. Oh, goodness. We're gonna put that like, fucking 80% cooldown. No regrets. So, I say we go... Maybe we go Hydras later in the build. As much as I'd like to rush Hydras, I feel like it's kind of essential to do, like, kind of good with Guan. I'm so excited for this event. Like, I miss Bumpas, I'm not gonna lie. Like... I know it was OP and stuff like that, but there is something something special about being able to like play like Sylvanas actually, or not just Sylvanas, but like Guardians in general actually being able to do something. Like if just Guardians or like shit tiers could build it, man, oh, what a game it would be. Ah, gamer subs. Bumba's Ares chains though, dude. Oh my goodness. It actually gave some of those gods a chance, you little fucker. It actually did give a lot of them a chance. And I am curious to see how cool this is, uh, how this is gonna work. I was think I think Camazots would actually work a little better with this. But I kinda just wanted to play one, and I feel like it's easy to proc the heal as opposed to waiting for your two. Or jumping with your three, I guess. That's an easy way to activate it. Oh, wow. Better ult this way, bucko. That guy was a bum. I'm kind of nervous he's going to F6. <laughs> that would not be good. That would make this exp- Hey! Where'd those archers or those melees go? Maybe I, like, give him a kill or something? No. Alright, 
I can get second tier defense here. Things do not bode well for me if I don't recover. I just, just uh, like maybe we just don't get hydras, but I'll feel dirty, man. So we'll go regrowth Most into. <sighs> so I don't even remember the name of it. It's a scepter. Okay. Sekmet. Sugma. Literally just a Sugma joke, I swear. I did not know this item existed. Does anyone even build it? Also, how are you guys today, by the way? I hope you're having a lovely... Wednesday, my friends. I'm having a good day myself. Father came over. A little bit. Helped me with my lawn. Or my lawn mower. My normal lawn mower is broken. So he gave me a hand. You got me in an awkward spot here, broski. It's so nice having a fucking good relationship with my father. I don't know what the fuck I would have done if I was a homeowner and I didn't have my dad helping me. Like, I didn't even know how to hang shit up before. Double kill! I must go all out. Let's go. I don't know, but just little things like, you know, piping and all that shit, man. Just everything to do with that home? Oh my goodness. Fuck. I'm grateful for it. I didn't have the absolute best relationship with my father when I was younger, but... A wise choice to improve my armor. You know? I was a kid, my parents were growing up as well. No sense in dwelling on it. I'm happy for my family. With my family. Shrek, shrek. All right, let's get this scepter going. I could do like the full scepter build. That could be a video idea. For another day. I think I'm gonna try streaming for the first time, since you know side effects and everything. Medication. I'm gonna try and stream today. Probably not gonna have a webcam, but I'm feeling a little better. So I'll be streaming just Baldur's Gate with the boys. So that'll be fun. If you want to stop by and say hello, we've been having a lot of fun. I'm a monk. I'm a monk who is really acrobatic and I can jump really high. Because I have these jumping boots and it's so much fun! Baldur's Gate is so much fun! <laughs> Genuinely, it's so much fucking fun. Don't do it. Okay, thank you. One must booster their strength for I'm gonna get beads. As much as I don't think I need them, I would have preferred to blink. I kinda wanna get upgraded beads. If we can get to that stage late game. Your middle tower is under attack. My goodness, dude. We are gonna be rocking it. Oh yeah. If you ever buy gamer subs, like even if you don't buy from me, let's say you have some gamer subs on you. I'm telling you, what the fuck? Dark. Sir! <laughs> You appear to be an idiot. I'm gonna eat your ass. I am. Did you ult? You ulted it, didn't you, little pervert? Beware the shifting sands. Killing people is rad. You know, that was smart to have gotten it there, but I, you know, I would have just fucking left, I think. That would have been my plan. I would, or back, sorry. <laughs> I hope you're all staying hydrated. But anyways, I saw Weekend does this. I saw him do it, and I was like, huh. A fine tool so we're technically max cooldown right now. We'll go Bobble yeah. next. So I have to use an ability on an enemy. But the thing is, like, you, it only lasts for, what, six seconds? Five seconds. So I can't just spam my three. If I hold my three, it's not going to reset the cooldown of other abilities. Stay with me. And there's a cooldown on it, so I need to measure that out appropriately. Motherfucker! Did you go? And wanted me to walk in front of that pillar. I don't swing that way, bro. Keep your pillar away from me. Oh. 
This is crazy. Look at the cooldown resets. Fantastic, bro. Nice. Now we just need Bobble, dude. Ooh, baby. It's going to be crazy. We got ourselves a video. I don't think that that's Phoenix yet, though. I missed my regrowth proc. Oh, that was almost bad. Oh. I could probably kill you right now, but I think you'd have six. I'm being honest. Can't really fit a Heart Seeker in this building. It's got a lot of additional exp uh, HP. I don't think I could fit a Heart Seeker. I, like, I probably need, I mean, I could just skip Hydras altogether. Like, I guess I don't really need it. Hmm, one must bolster their strength for battle. And I could just go, because I need Pen, so we could get, like, Heartseeker and Serrated, maybe? Bro, I'm not going to fight you until I get Bobble online, because I at least want to test it once. In case this game suddenly ends abruptly. Yeah, putting ice in your gamer subs. Just putting a bunch of ice. Tastes... Mm, it tastes better. I don't know why. I don't, don't ask me why, but putting ice in it actually makes it taste better. It's weird. Your middle tower is under attack. Yeah! All right, on her. Time to test it out. I'm full cooldown. Damn it! I need a, I need to hit you. Stay in the fight. Beware the ship. Stay with me. I was more so looking at the cooldown resets than... Ah! Unfortunate. Again. Jesus, the man did not consent. <laughs> it was a death cry. I was... Dude, I was just taking it, bro. I, fu I feel like a slut. I just took it. I should have fucking fought back a little bit. I was paying so much attention to, to like, how this, uh, scepter works. Basically, don't it affects each time you damage an enemy god. So, including auto attacks? Not any time I damage a god. Not including tick damage, I presume, obviously. Huh. How the fuck does this work? Hmm, one must bolster their strength for battle. So auto attacks, so auto attack cancels in general would be good. But I have to heal to start the fight. It's the thing. It isn't a big deal, but that's like where Hydras would be fucking useful as shit. Yeah, I need pen. Quite badly. Did you really not do bolding back there? Fuck! No! So much for MF6! This is falling off really quickly! No! I should have a Heartseeker Hydras, I think. Fuck! Oh no, I'm throwing! No! Not like this, bro. The ADCs come online. Executioner. My only weakness. Fuck, this isn't good. <laughs> it's a problem with Guan Yu as like you go late game against uh, a hunter. I literally saw this matchup and I was like, ah, fuck, if we get late game. Like, I had the advantage early. Like, I have a lot of knock up immunity, protection shred. Works really well. But as time goes on, when homie just left clicks, think about my three. You think my three shredding as much damage as an on her just holding left click? You think my ult's doing that damage? I gotta use my ult as a fucking... My ult is quite simply... Oh fuck, and you have lifesteal. No! Why do you beat stick, dude? You're tearing me apart on her! 
Okay, buddy. You can't look at me and then walk towards bullying them. Charge! Just, just... No. Like, I need beat stick. Fuck, but I need heart seeker. Maybe we say fuck it to the beat stick and just fine pray. We can just burst them. To an end. Uh, that's the only that's the only thing about bobble and duel you gotta be careful of. Oh Beware the shifting Stay with me. Stay in the fight. Stay with me. Beware the shifting sands. Retreat may be the best choice. Charge. Fuck, I'm alive. Oh, that was tough! Jesus! I think Heartseeker will do wonders, but fuck me. I put more, like, I'm not even paying attention to the cooldown resets. Like, they're, they're, they're nice, little resets, but... I'm not gonna pay attention. I'm paying more the fuck attention to just trying to kill him. Like, I screwed up when I was trying to... just test the waters with this. Okay, it's actually fine. No, not really. I lied. It's probably not fine. But I'm gonna get red. So that's cool. I really want Heartseeker! Heartseeker red! I'd actually have a fucking chance. Thousand percent. This is a tool. But yeah, Bobble, like, you just need so many items, right? Like, it just takes up so much of the build, it's, it can be difficult to counterplay. I'm gonna probably have to give up Phoenix, I bet. Artsigar's gonna help a lot with all that additional HP he has, though. Stay in the, fight. the damage are good. It's good. Our cooldowns are good. We don't have anti-heal. Azzy's not the worst thing in the world, though. It's not like it's a Devos. Like our damage is there, man. Like, our damage is there. That's twice now! I really wish I had Shelf of the Dexter. So as Aegis is down, we're gonna keep that in mind. I would love to fight him with Heartseeker and Red. I need to fight him now. Next engagement. We'll have Shell up. His Shell will be up as well. That's okay. Alright, let's do this. He's gonna have Dom though. That's gonna shred us to fucking high hell. One must booster this thing yeah. for battle. Upgraded Shell. Fuck. Alright. Stay with me. Beware the shifting sand. Stay in the fight. The sand. Stay with me. There we go! That's what we need, dude! Yes! It's exactly what we fucking needed. Like I said, fight with Red Heartseeker. Even if he has lifesteal. A little fucking chance. Hydra cancels would be crazy there, right? Like, look at how much I'm auto attacking in between that, though. The only thing. Can imagine Hydra's on this Phoenix here. It's a shame. Didn't quite get the minions in there in time. No biggie. Uh, I'm gonna upgrade my beads so that we get cooldown. Like, this cooldown shit is awesome, but it doesn't make much of a difference when he's able to just, you know, auto-attack us in between the abilities. Like, I just need to be auto-canceling with them more than anything, and positioning myself appropriately. Easier said than done, of course, but... The shell's gonna be up before ours as well, because he had an upgrade, gotta keep that in mind. Red's coming up relatively soon, he's aware of that. Just spawned. I'd really prefer him to not get that, but... Charge! Things do not bode well for me if I don't recover. Oh my fucking god! My HP! That was so scary! Holy shit, did you 
did you see that? Where did it go? What the fuck was that? Your Titan is under attack. Beware the shifting sands. Bro, I I don't really okay. Well, that was still fun. I still had a good time. I really needed like a hydras or something. I feel like I we needed ants. Like we needed a lot of things, unfortunately. Well, I did try my best. I still had fun. That was a really cool concept. I feel like if we if we did that during like a casual game, maybe like that would work out a little better because people wouldn't be counterbuilding against you completely. Like you could just run up on someone, All right? Like we we did a, we, we did a good job. We won the early, but we fell off late. That's it's not surprising. <laughs> nice build, thank you. But yeah, if you did that in like a casual, like you'd be able to pull it off because the person, for example, wouldn't be building your specific defense against you. You know all that shit, and they wouldn't have like shell usually shit like that. So if you want to try this out, I recommend it in casual. Uh, if you if, in terms of what I would actually build, if this was another like a normal one you game. Transcendence, Thanks. Transcendence, Regrowth, Hydras, Eat Stick, maybe Titan's Heartseeker, or Serrated Heartseeker, it's up to you. I like Serrated for the movement. Anyways, thanks for watching guys, hope you enjoyed. Leave a like if you did, subscribe if you're new to the channel, and we have a good one. Peace.